I would like to demonstrate some Raspberry Pi uh, sound analysis software that I've written using Python. Um, it also uses a, a USB microphone as the audio input. It's all real time and uh, basically just demonstrate what this application does. First of all, um, primarily I thought it would be very very handy as a, a, a musical training tool. If uh, I was to sing or hum Now, the musical notes there three different colours you can see. The um, green is uh, only one hair away from the true frequency of that note. White is one and a half to two hertz and uh, red is anything greater than two hertz. So, I mean, initially I designed this as a, a guitar tuner. I'll just get the guitar right here <coughs> or see. Is it this? So we've got guitar. So <clears throat> it could be used for um, sort of vocal training. As you can see it's pretty accurate. One of the main motivations behind doing this was to uh, help myself with the uh, clarinet which I've just recently got. I've never played a clarinet before and then um, I know it's also doing my uh, mouse position. So he here's the clarinet um, playing and you'll see that as I change my mouthpiece uh, how it changes the accuracy of the note. size of the note determines the um, the volume. Every now and again it will track, uh, you know, background creaks and cracks, it's just obviously ambient sounds. There is a sort of software noise gate built in here. Penny whistle, same sort of thing. So it's quite good as a training tool for um, monitoring uh, levels or um, even the you know the amount of uh, pressure that one's putting on the, the breath.
Anyway, that's that's it. There's there's a whole load of other things you can do. You can uh, uh, there's features that I've put in just to make it look cool. <laughs> um, you can do lines. More of a graphic type of thing. Ooh, And of course you can just build up images over a period of time. Uh, you can save, once you've done your your uh, analysis, you can save, to press uh, a button on the keyboard and it will save it as a picture as well. Anyway, I just wanted to share uh, just some of the things that I've been doing with the Raspberry Pi and that's one of them. Thanks very much for watching. Bye.